Hey folks, Daily Lands Blog Lower. here. Elbows back. 47, 48. It's not, forward. what are you, like the, the trainer here, Case? The point of this is not that. Daily Lands Blog, okay? Okay. I'm a little out of breath. I mean, I did a lot of push-ups there. A lot yeah. of push-ups. Okay, I'm still in my spin clothes. So I was thinking a lot about, you know, exercise and the idea that if you can do 10 push-ups one day and you do that every day, you, you, you build up. And then you're at 12 and then you're at 15. You gain strength. And I'm thinking about this. This is kind of my life well, on depression. Just pan over because he's eating a bone <laughs> right. <laughs> that, is, uh, that is so cute. Uh, the bone part, not so cute. You go into a pet store. You have, I mean, you, you've been there with me, Case. Um, you don't want to know what they're giving you. They say, oh, would you like it? No, 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 no. I don't want to hear the body part. I don't want to hear it. And then they'll go, it's, it's, uh, lar uh, no, I don't want to hear. All right. Well, I may be slightly off topic. Yeah. So here's my point, is that the roller coaster that many are on uh, with depression and anxiety, you have a good day, have a bad day is to me, if you look at it like it's a form of exercise, you can get better at handling it. Every time you go from good to bad and bad to good, when you're having a good day, you file it away. You say to yourself, okay, well, how often does this happen? Oh, wait a second here. It's happened five times in the last month or 10 times in the last year, whatever it is. And you use that to get stronger. So next time you're down here, you're able to say, well, I was thinking about it last time, and I've gone through this now 10 times in the last month. So instead of believing that I'm here to stay, that the sense of hopelessness is so pervasive, you say, okay, well, I know. I've gone through this before, and it will pass. And you build up strength. And I can tell you that I have done that. My ability to handle the ups and downs is way better now than it has ever been. I can do it. Um, I'm probably halfway there. Uh, I used to panic every time I had a bad day thinking, oh my gosh, this is, the f this is what's going to be a terrible day in the future and I'm never going to get out of this and oh my God. But now I built up the strength from having good days and bad days to know on a bad day, I've gone through this 25 times in the last four months. It's not going to last. It's going to come back and it's going to go and I'm just going to ride it out. You can build up that strength. But you have to focus when you're having a good day on the fact that um, you are going to have a bad day and prepare yourself for it. Because when you're having a bad day, you can't really think about anything. You can't focus on anything. You just try to survive. SickNowWeek.com, 24 hours a day, 364 days a year. We're here because we know things that you should know. And specifically, I've been through a lot that I'd like to help you with. You going to do some burpees now? Burpees? Okay, yeah, you, you cut the camera and don't show the bone. Oh my God, it's horrible. Oh, would you like a thigh bone? No, I, I, I don't, I don't want to hear that. Well, how about a larynx? No, oh God, no.